Jimmy welcomes you back to Jimmy Negatron. Or Jimmy versus Jimmy Negatron or something. Man, I don't know if I've ever even seen a check mark above all these levels. Huh. Anyway, so we're gonna play as Goddard this time. Ooh. Pretty much plays exactly the same, I'm pretty sure. I don't think I ever noticed a difference at least. So we have hearts to pick up this time, I guess? I do know Scarred has a slightly different colored weapon. Also seems to start with less charge, unless I just didn't have charge. This thing doesn't trust me. I think it's just that my lack of charge carried over from the last level. Which is kind of weird that Jimmy and Gar would share a charge, but whatever. How aggressive are you? Not especially, at least. Ah! Come on! Goddard seems to have to wait longer to attack again, too. I don't know if it, it still takes two hits to get rid of these bouncing balls, so... I don't know if Goddard's attack is any more powerful. Ah. This one at least I can get around. Again, it's not too big of a deal if these things hit me anyways. So it's not really too much. Give me coins. Give me a little butterfly. Ah. Ah. Good respawn. Thank you for respawning in a nice safe location. Landmarks. Okay. So I need to get over here at some point. Maybe I should get rid of that enemy. Just a little tough when I have this butterfly to worry about. Well, butterflies don't really seem to be doing much to me. Sometimes butterflies sit down on the ground, sometimes they don't. Really strange to me. That was totally the wrong diamond. I didn't have that much range for it either. Kind of confusing these giant hearts don't give you health. Even though I realize they represent something other than health. You still use a big heart on the top left corner to represent health. That was just me jumping straight into a mostly stationary obstacle. I don't know how much, this is, how much of this is that the game's hard, and how much of it is that... I'm just doing a really bad job. Uh, hi. You look like a shield or something. I guess if I didn't already have a shield, that would be a shield. So I have a shield, except it does anything. You know. Can I stand on these? Yes, that's really strange. Secret area, it's not your secret to me. I guess you, the big secret was you had to figure out how to... Like, there's an arrow on here. You had to figure out you can stand on that. Except there's only an arrow pointing at it, too. Lots of secret areas, quote-unquote, in games have... Ah! Giant arrows pointing to them, I find. Ah! Something I'd jump over. What was that? I think that was kind of weird. I also have no idea where I am in relation to pretty much anything else right now. I don't seem to notice me. Ah! Hey! 
Come on. At least this game gives you mercy and invincibility. If it didn't, that would be really cruel. I realize it's a tank, but how much health can this thing have? No idea where the... ...tangible part of this platform ends. Thank you. Jeez. Alright. Oh, look at that, too! Generosity! Being nice to me today. Goddard, why do you charge so slow? You, know you definitely don't do more damage. I don't know what the deal is. Well, it's not, oh, it's not that he, char he charges more slowly. I think it's he. I think it's that he needs. He uses more energy when he attacks. Which would make sense if it did more damage, but as far as I can tell, it's not the case. So you should use all of my energy whenever I attack. I don't see any upside to Goddard so far, though. So I might have to use that. Um, pay more attention to my radar, too. Thanks. That actually sent me forward in a weird way. It's kind of annoying. That's not how you announce it. It's kind of annoying that the game doesn't really give much indication as to which way to go on a fork to actually progress in level and which way to go to go off the path to oops, oops. pick something up. Drop something. I am a rich dog right now. Nothing else. I haven't been there. It's probably where the last heart is. I think we're gonna see a lot more of this though, having to backtrack to find stuff we missed. Yep, there you go. I don't know how this room makes us any trust me or I need her to trust me, but whatever. Speed run. So this thing don't fall off, I'll oh, not that way. I don't think. I'll should be well. Let's put case of trouble last time. Ah, look at that. I think I've already missed coins somewhere at some point. I'm not gonna worry about the some coin completion on this level. Do you need to charge the shield somehow or what? I don't remember how that works. Holding down the attack button does nothing. No, although the world was rotating for some reason. Not rotating. Vibrating for some reason. Wait on R, that's just the usual, that's what I was before. Oh! That will actually lets you strafe. That would be a lot more useful if I shot stuff more often. But I can't, because I don't have enough ammunition to shoot stuff often. I like it. Oh, jeez. Might be useful for bosses. Am I gonna survive this? I have to buy some more health. Final challenge. Okay. That was on the rack at the end. Okay. Let's go back to that park. Okay. Zoom. No, not that way. Zoom this way. Shop is in the center, vaguely. There you go. It's trying to make dirt for some reason. Well, that's where shield is. I'm tempted. Why can't, why can't I buy that though? Huh? I'm, just, I'm not quite understanding here. 
Oh jeez, that is not where the... Wow, that's not that expensive. I'd rather not die though. I don't know if it... I can't buy shit right now anyway, so... I guess I won't. And how much is the life? It was too much for me to buy. Oh, there, that's right. Absurd. Although it probably does cost about the same amount as refilling your life, actually. Okay, so for the first time in my life, I've actually gone through levels here, so... I guess we'll run over to the third level. We'll probably cut off fairly fairly quickly. Bad dream. You don't have to do these in order, by the way, so I've been here before. I just never completed it. But Jimmy seems to be much better at shooting stuff more quickly, so I'm gonna go with that. Defeat the ten dark bears. We're gonna defeat some dark bears next episode. Apparently Cindy's afraid of Halloween or something, considering... And Christmas! Maybe just Barbers based off of the decor here. I think that tank always confused me, because I don't think I quite understood. Jeez. I don't think I could quite see against the background here that that tank was actually shooting stuff at me. I think I understood the connection between the tank and stuff being shot at me, but I don't think I could see its projectiles. I see another shield, I don't know. Oh, what? You can shoot above the ground! Nice, we'll deal with our new found tank opponent next time in the next episode. Let's play. Will I? Uh, no, it's gonna be a little bit short if I do that right now. So, I the idea is here. It's like it enables a shield, but I can't actually use it. The views here are a lot more abundant, aggressive. Oh, well, look at that slowdown. Kind of. Well, my frame rate is still being recorded as a full 6 frames per second for some reason. Okay, I don't know why this thing so hard for me to time. But the game is noticeably slowing down. For some reason, to actually be able to record this game, what are you doing? Come on now. I need to run it in software mode, which is really slow. You don't normally run anything in software mode for like actual practical playing purposes on emulators. Look at this, I need so little ammunition to actually attack. It's awesome. Could you die a little faster, please? I do wonder if uh, against enemies like this one, Goddard would actually require fewer shots. But since I can shoot more often, it doesn't really matter. But why do you have so much health? Dude! I don't think these things have less health on in order to build I wonder if that's the only thing that changes, like how much damage you take and how much health enemies have. Oh my god. Is there something I'm supposed to be doing here that I'm missing? I hope I'm missing something. Oops. Uh, not, not my shots. I still got the enemies. Nope, he just takes like 10 hits. Well, we're gonna have fun next episode trying to do that same thing against nine other enemies. Record to that. See you next time, everyone. Ah, oh, I wasn't trying to press that. <laughs>